Smartworks is a large compressor manufacturer with a revenue of $4.2 billion. Their production falls into three divisions, industrial compressors, mobile compressors, and dental compressors. They wanted to streamline the process and introduce automation where it would generate the most value. For this purpose, they needed to understand their P2P process better by discovering process insights. Data for the following SAP transactions in both the procurement side and the accounts payable side was uploaded into the tool. This was used to identify bottlenecks, repetitive tasks, and to understand the potential for improvement opportunities across the end-to-end -end process. In this investigation, we generated insights based on cycle time and rework analysis for the procurement side of the process. Smartworks were keen to reduce the number of resources in procurement, but they did this before initiating this improvement process. The implications of this are evident from the graph of their overall P2P cycle time, increasing constantly after January, as this is where the resource reallocation occurred. Here we have a process discovery diagram, which shows exactly what the end-to-end -end process looks like from real data. You can visualize important process behaviors, such as rework instances or backwards flows, which will ultimately delay the process. We can also use value widgets to display important figures, for example, the total number of cases, POs, process variants, the average procurement cycle time, and the overall P2P cycle time. This time series simply shows how many POs were raised each month. In the Procurement Cycle Times Phases chapter, we can find the cycle time of key procurement tasks. We can also view this by segment, PO type, company, vendor, or PO value range. For example, here we can use a threshold to display how different PO types perform compared to the overall average. In this case, the framework order and normal procurement POs are performing worse than the overall average. By analyzing the process discovery diagram, we can easily see which tasks in procurement phase take the most time to process. For example, when it comes to unsuccessful three-way matches, the flow goes back from complete invoice to goods receipt, which increases the cycle time by eight days to 20 hours. The next chapter is devoted to PO approvals. Smartworks do not have an assigned RACI matrix for their PO approval cycle. Therefore, employees take time determining who to send the approvals to and on occasion, send it to their friends for convenience. The PO approval takes six days and seven hours to process, which is nearly 30% of the average procurement cycle time. Smartworks has set a global PO approval cycle target time of one day. However, 16% of all POs do not meet this target. 84% of these POs have a rework instance, which again is exceptionally high. PO approvals that take more than one day increase the overall P2P cycle time significantly to up to 76 days, 23 hours. This investigation focuses on the accounts payable section of the end-to-end -end process. It is SmartWorks company policy for all invoices to go through an approval step. However, we found that 15% of the cases bypass this step. The average cycle time of three days and eight hours is significantly high, which presents an opportunity for automation. The process discovery diagram for invoice approvals is showing us that 14,885 PO line items skip the invoice approval step whilst 15,207 PO line items go from invoice approved back to complete invoice. The root cause for this backward flow 
is unsuccessful three-way matches, which we will now focus our analysis on. The goal of three-way matching is to highlight any deviation in the purchase order, goods receipt and invoices in order to save businesses from overspending or paying for an item they did not receive. For Smartworks, 40% of all three-way matches were unsuccessful. The goods receipt was the most common cause of failure, accounting for 52% of all three-way matches failures. These two bar charts show how failed three-way matches affect the different cycle times phases for the accounts payable section. In order to prevent these delays and improve the efficiency of the P2P process, Smartworks should investigate the high percentage of rework loops around complete invoice and approve invoice, optimize SAP's configuration to best facilitate the procure-to-pay process, specifically around PO approvals.